Yeah. So yesterday, there were tears and joy at schools all across South Africa as brave young learners stepped into primary school for the very first time to start their grade one year, which is an incredibly special moment for both the parents and the young learners. And we were there to capture all of those emotions. In the Western Cape alone, more than one million learners across the province kicked off the school year, including new Grade 1 learners at Camps Bay Primary School. Oh, as a parent, I'm very excited because my child is growing, going to Grade 1. I couldn't expect this. A lot of nervousness, I guess. Yeah, more just, for them than for my child. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. I'm more nervous for the teachers than I am for him. I was really excited. And I couldn't wait to go to school to make new friends and to study. She couldn't even sleep at night. She was just, I can't wait to go to school. She was so excited. She woke up really early and got into uniform straight away. Couldn't eat breakfast. <laughs> I really feel ready to be a grade one. I'm really excited for everything I want to win. Lots of trophies. I want to learn um, about counting all the way to the highest number. I'm excited about it to be um, reading because I really want to read more. The first day in big school can be an emotional roller coaster for families. Thankfully, they are calm and experienced teachers who make the day joyful for everyone. So the start of the day was busy and fun and one or two tears, but not too many. Children are very excited, so we had a great start to the day. They were all really excited, and I find that the grade ones at the beginning of the year, they're ready to go, they want to work, they were asking me in the beginning, when are we going to do the reading, when are we going to do the writing? So the vibe was really good, they were happy and excited. The hardest thing on the first day of school is dealing with children who are very anxious, but luckily today we had a great start, so we didn't have any problems. There's so much attached to that first day. Routines start from day one. Uh, punctuality, having all the things you need to have, it's a vital day, really. Getting to know the routine in class, at playtime, getting to know their teacher, and just enjoying their day at school. Among the advice on preparing for grade one, parents suggest doing research on the new school, rehearsing getting ready for the big day, and having a good routine. Okay, the advice I gave her, I told her to study hard, to pay attention to the teachers, to be a good girl. I'll just tell her that she must work hard, make friends, new friends, listen to the teacher. If she doesn't understand what the teacher is saying, she must ask the teacher there, what did you say? They told me that um, you have to be very good at school and you have to act like a real grade one. Saying goodbye is never easy, but we have little uh, structures at school to make it easier for parents. So grade one parents allowed in the classroom, five, ten minutes, take their photo, and then it's goodbye. Grade two parents, no, they don't go in. So yes, it, it is tough on the parents. But they all manage, they all have that first day in grade one. Remember that, you know, all children have to go through this, and I know it's difficult for them, but Children are more resilient and stronger than we realize, and even if they go through a few bumps, it's part of life, and they will, you know, learn how to get back up on their feet. And, um, you know, grade one is such an important year, and the main thing is just to show support and um, encouragement from home. Advice for parents when their children are starting grade one, prepare them for the day, discuss it with them beforehand, get all their little things ready so they can be excited, and just have a very good positive attitude towards it. For the children and parents, there's lots to learn and hopefully a happy first day paves the way for many more fruitful and enjoyable school days to come.